meeting wisdom. Wisdom, the wise man says, is this principal thing. He continued and said that with all your getting, get wisdom. And in all of your getting, you get understanding. Why is it that the height of what the pursuit of man is, is in the search for wisdom and truth? It is simple. Wisdom is a personality. There is the spirit of wisdom. And there is wisdom as a spirit, as a person, as a personality. It is difficult for people to encounter wisdom by themselves, for you cannot find wisdom unless wisdom first finds you. And this is the conclusion of the matter. We are in a time where knowledge has increased. And that is good. But that is bad also. Now, by prophecy and by the trajectories of our times and civilizations, we are at a point where knowledge has increased. And we can see that all around us with science and technology and the piercing of humans into realms unimaginable, bringing up technology and biology and changing the very form of life itself. But that is knowledge. And the reason why it seems like knowledge has been corrupted is because of the times and the season that we're in. The only weapon we can use against this vast knowledge that is going forward is wisdom. You cannot combat knowledge with knowledge, you will lose. You can only combat knowledge with wisdom and to search for that wisdom isn't easy. But I'm glad to announce to you that at this time we have this rare opportunity where we will get to meet wisdom. Wisdom will open up of herself unto us. And through that, we understand things from another vista. We see things from another realm. We begin to see that many of the things we have learned, we've been taught, we've been educated, and even the inspiration that has come to us have some elements of falsehood in them and as much as there is an element of falsehood you cannot get truth in it for wisdom and truth go together i do not speak of the wisdom of man or the wisdom of the world i speak of the wisdom that created the heavens and the earth and all civilizations and the systems and the structures and its complexities and similarities bringing up patterns and systems together through it what we call life is formed. One thing I want you to understand is that wisdom is a creative force. It is not static. It is always moving. And that is why wisdom always drives you to more. It opens your mind to see from another level, grasp vistas and dimensions beyond your time. Few men have encountered wisdom, and it is difficult for their names to be forgotten. For wisdom is that thing that helps you to transcend the realms of time, as it were. And we will be meeting wisdom, for wisdom has said that she will meet with us. We will grow into the knowledge of spirituality, finance, commerce, politics, and even neuro-social political dissections. Because these are the weapons that we need to fight, to live, and to disrupt the processes and the systems of this world. So you will do yourself some good to come with pens and papers and pads, for you will arrive. For when wisdom opens of herself to you, you will arrive. My name is Harkanizo Kenny Mile. I'm the Spirit Mentalist. And I hope to see you on the 22nd of December 2018 at Meeting Wisdom.